Being an artist, I get to express myself and creativity in many different ways through singing, sewing, and painting. And what I love about painting is that I get to express myself visually and it's really relaxing. You know what? I feel like relaxing today. So I'm going to take you to Color Me Wine where we're going to be painting beautiful artwork on ceramics. Hi everyone, welcome to On The Go with Trish. That's me. We're here at Color Me Mine in Costa Mesa, California. A really fun and cool place to go to create your own ceramic artwork. So if you're looking for something fun to do or to create your own gifts, then you're in for a treat. Let's see how it works. The first step is to pick the ceramic that you want to paint on. So let me see what I want to do. Mm. This dog is cute. He reminds me of my dog. And I have a cat, but I'm a practical person, so I don't really like knickknacks. There's cups you could paint on. No, I'm not really a coffee drinker in a cup. <laughs> There's also kitchen work. I need this stuff. Here we go. A bowl. I need a big bowl to eat fa. <laughs> so this is perfect. Now that I found the ceramic that I want to paint on, is the next step is to pick the paint. So let me see. I think I'm going to paint a cherry blossom on my fa bowl. So what you do is pick five colors and you put it on here and they have so many options of colors that you could choose from on this chart. So what you do is pick your colors and I think I'm going to do pink, brown and green themes. So I'll choose the colors here and I put it on the ceramic here. So let's see. So I just chose all the colors that I want to choose for my bowl and he went to go get the paint. So I guess now we just wait. Thank you. <laughs> I feel like you just served me food. So I'm painting my base of the bowl. Normally you're supposed to paint it this way and then go back this way. But I'm just gonna do the lazy way. My last coat. Yes. Now that I've waited a few minutes for my bowl to dry, I'm going to start drawing my cherry blossoms. Um, but if you aren't that into drawing, they have these stamps that you could use. Um, this has flowers, so it's kind of close to what I'm going to do. Or these stencils that you could just, you know, put on there and just paint it on. But what I'm going to do is just going to paint it freehand. Here we go. As you can see, I'm drawing my cherry blossoms right now with the pink paint over my brown stems. I don't really know what a cherry blossom looks like. I'm kind of making it up. This brush is really nice. It makes these um, branches really easy to make. <laughs> All right, I'm done painting the outside of my bowl and I'm going to sign my name at the bottom before I flip it and do the inside. What do you guys think about my name? Pretty good, huh? Now I'm ready to paint the inside of my bowl. This is gonna hold a lot of fun. Well, here it is, my piece of art. I know it's not exactly finished, but we still need to get it fired, which usually takes three to seven days. But don't worry, you'll get to see it with the help of editing magic. 
And don't forget, if you plan on doing this as a gift, plan ahead of time. Thanks to Color and Remind in Costa Mesa, California for letting me stop by and paint. If you want to have as much fun as I did, stop by and check them out. Well, that's all for this week. I'm Trish, and thanks for watching On The Go With Trish. Check us out every week here at www.olacoy.com. Bye!